Well, welcome back. When Upstate Teen got the chance of a lifetime when he was asked to join a popular rock band on stage at a recent concert. Well, what happened next surprised not only the crowd, but the rockers <laughs> themselves. <laughs> this is a pretty cool story. Fox Carolina Carrie Weimer met up with the teen today to talk tunes, guitars, and what it's like to be a real life rock star. She's live in Spartanburg at Broome High School with an incredible story of determination. Hey, Carrie. <laughs> Hey there, you know guys, I met this kid and he, he's pretty good, but I had to challenge him, you know, I had to see just kind of where he stood, uh, you know, I don't want to embarrass him, but we were going to have a little contest here, a little challenge, so let's see how this goes. Now let's hear what you got. Come back. And... Clearly, I was the winner there, so, uh, so yeah. So let me tell you a great story about Clay Case. This is one that you don't want to miss. With the flick of a switch, a guitar strap in place, and hours of practice flowing from his hands, Clay Case, a 17-year-old Broom High School graduate, gives us a taste of his musical talents. We've been rooting him on all along. We've known his talent. It's just a matter of getting him at the right place at the right time. And that right place was at a Green Day concert in Atlanta's Truist Park on Tuesday. I knew they pulled people up to play, but I didn't think I'd ever be able to. Clay was determined to get on stage and play with his favorite band. So with front row tickets and a sign asking to please play the guitar, he waited patiently. A couple songs before I flashed it and Billy kind of looked at it and looked at it, I noticed and then he just kind of walked back. He texted us and said, Mom and Dad, you know, it, there's a chance I might go up on stage and play. Clay's parents were not ticket holders, but were outside the concert venue. They had no idea what was about to happen. Didn't know it until they, the crowd started chanting, Clay, Clay, Clay. Green Day's lead singer had Clay brought up on stage. Fan footage shared with us shows how surprised the singer was to see how good Clay could actually play. So impressed, in fact, that he asked him to keep playing for another song and then sent an autographed guitar home with the Broom alumni. It actually happened. I got to play with, you know, my heroes and stuff. He was a shy kid, you know, in high school, but that music has always been his outlet. Clay says he hopes his experience will move others to never give up on your dreams. I want someone at least to be inspired to go do what they want or go play music, go do, just go do that one thing they wanted to do. Now Clay tells me while he doesn't mind a career in music, he's also going back to school for computer programming. And I have a feeling that this guy right here is going to be a success no matter which one he chooses. Cody, Brooklyn. <laughs> so I just have to be the judge here. I think he beat you, Carrie. <laughs> But Carrie had some pretty impressive skills. Yeah. I didn't know you that you knew how to play guitar like that. I mean, pretty you're awesome. good. You're good. I just yeah. You it's are. It's amazing good. what this guy can teach you in just a few seconds. I tell you, <laughs> he's out of this world. Well, Carrie, I can't wait for your next concert. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Thanks.